Today I'm going to talk you through collagraph printing. You'll need some newspaper down, your plate, you're also going to need an ink tray, some ink, a brayer, also known as a roller, and a paintbrush. Now first things first, you get probably about a pea-sized amount onto your ink tray and you're going to use your brayer just to cover the, the roller in the ink. You're going to do that until it makes a sticky sound. You're then gonna roll that over your plate and you'll see the only main parts that are picking up the ink are the raised parts which have been covered with the string. You're then gonna press that down onto your piece of paper. Now it's important to use quite a lot of force and ensuring that you're rubbing it with the back of your, your fingers and you're just pressing that down to make sure the whole of the, the plate has been covered. Lift that up and that leaves you with the print. Alternatively, you could use um, a paintbrush. So cover that with some ink and you're just going to paintbrush over the string. You'll see that gets into the nooks and crannies a little bit better than the brayer itself. And you're just gonna quickly um, do that to the whole of the plate, ensuring that all the string is covered in the ink. Once you've done that, you're again going to press the reverse side onto the paper. And you could use the back of your fingers or your hand and use circular motions, or you could use a spoon. Using a spoon, you could rub over um, the plate and that is called burnishing. You then lift it up and that'll leave you with a much clearer plate print. Here it is again, just to recap the details. And that's how you do collagraph printing.